When working with rational expressions, it's easy to forget an important side note that follows every problem, and that is that there are certain values that are excluded from the domain or are not allowed to be plugged in for x in the rational expression. In this problem, we're going to see if we can identify what those excluded values are that we cannot use in our domain or for values of x. We're looking at x squared minus 1 over 3x squared plus 5x. A rational expression is, to use the term loosely, a fancy fraction. And the important thing we remember about fractions is that we can never have 0 on the bottom. We don't care what's on top of the fraction in the numerator, but the denominator can never be 0. So when we're asked to find the excluded values of this fraction, we don't really care about the numerator. What we really care about is the denominator, 3x squared plus 5x, cannot be equal to 0. So let's solve it like we would any other equation equal to 0, and those would be the bad values for the fraction. When solving with an x squared, we often will solve it by factoring. The greatest common factor here is x, leaving behind 3x plus 5. That's not equal to 0. Once it's factored, we can set each factor equal to 0, or in this case, not equal to 0. This includes the GCF of x is not equal to 0, and the 3x plus 5 is not equal to 0 already have that x is not equal to 0, the x is alone. The other equation we can quickly solve by subtracting 5, 3x is not equal to negative 5, and dividing by 3 to get x is not equal to negative 5 thirds. These are our excluded values that would make the denominator equal to 0. We can't have 0 in the denominator, so we find those values by making the equation equal to 0, or making the denominator equal to 0, and solving the resulting equation.